The Gerald R. Ford International Airport celebrated the first day of passengers using eight new gates. News 8's Kyle Mitchell has reaction from travelers. The first passengers into the new expanded concourse arrived from Detroit. They say the upgrades were really needed. After years of planning and construction. I use the airport, uh, you know, a couple times a month and I think it's going to be great. Passengers arrived into the brand new addition at the Gerald R. Ford International Airport. I travel a fair amount for work, so hopefully this, you know, more flights and just this, this whole air travel thing gets even easier. So um, Grand Rapids is super convenient and the airport's super convenient. Not, not a bad drive from Muskegon for me. So yeah, more, more destinations and more, uh, more flights would be great. The new addition has eight gates and will be used by Delta and American Airlines. Work is already underway to renovate the old Concourse A, which will be used by United. It's part of a $112 million expansion project. It's really a game changer for the airport here and the region. Uh, we accommodate the West Michigan growth here in population, so the airport is well positioned now to really accommodate the growing population here in West Michigan. We're always talking to our airline partners on adding additional service. Can you make a connection today in Philly? Like Beyond the additional gates and space the project brings, the new expansion will be able to accommodate bigger planes. I think I have been through the airport 10 times since January. The design of the space is also new to passengers like Virginia Downey, who is heading to North Carolina. It is inspired by nature in the Great Lakes. Three major West Michigan-based furniture companies are supplying the seating. This just kind of gives the space to unwind, wake up a little more slowly, um, not be on top of each other waiting. So just really nice. And the, the new kind of chairs, the variety of chairs, the fact they're stable, so it's nice. Restaurants will also begin opening in the coming months. The airport says expansion will help support future growth with two open gates on the concourse. Those open gates will be used for expansion for these existing carriers or potentially new carriers coming on board. Reporting from the Gerald R. Ford International Airport, Kyle Mitchell, News 8.